here, um, though it's 60 years plus now, uh, started out as being a uh, think tank or a research institution that was funded by the government and by the Ford Foundation uh, and it essentially was core support at that time. Over the years, that kind of core support declined and eventually we had become just a project-driven organization. What TTI has enabled us to do uh, is work on four types of capital that we then built into a strategy for NCER. We called it the 2020 strategy. What core support does is it enables you to take risks. NCR had become a very risk-averse organization. So it's allowed us to think very boldly about our future. And I think that's the biggest behavioral and attitudinal change that we've been able to bring about. And I think that's really important when you're thinking of rejuvenating. Because when you rejuvenate, you must have some backup. You don't want to fall and falter when you're trying to take chances. We also have the privilege of having collected the we almost think the world's first panel data set. Uh, it's called the Rural Economic and Demographic Survey. This survey, for example, the red survey, had been collected in various rounds and hadn't been archived properly. It hadn't been documented properly. Now, there's no project that we had that could fund that. We could have asked for it, but, you know, it was, it was an old data set. It was much in demand still. People had to figure out how to use this data set. We used TTI money to hire a first-rate global consultant from Chile who's worked extensively with surveys in this part of the region and with the World Bank and others. And he spent, I think, almost a month with us cleaning up the data, archiving it so that it is now publicly and more easily usable by others. There are similar instances where, for example, now uh, benefiting from the use that we put TTI to, we, in uh, recent months, we've set up and we've just launched an NCR National Data Innovation Center. Uh, that is being funded by the Gates Foundation. But again, uh, it's that confidence we have gained from having done these series of things that we can use to demonstrate our abilities in the proposal that we wrote for this, which was a competitive proposal. Uh, we were lucky to be the first amongst very significant 16 other uh, competitors. And we can trace back the achievements we've done with TTI funding and the confidence it's given us. And they were risky ventures, but we've succeeded. And that's obviously been a part of our proposal for this National Data Innovation Center, which we now have a very serious grant to build.